Good morning. It's wonderful to see all of you this morning. It's always wonderful whenever we gather. It's great to see you. Uh, those of you who uh, I've known for many years, and we have some visitors here today that I haven't met before, and it's always a, a good thing when we have visitors here at St. Paul. Um, we made the correct choice here this morning. You know, I like to say, there's other places we could be. There's other choices we could have been. Holy Spirit led us to make the correct choice. Holy Spirit led us to, to worship this morning together as brothers and sisters in faith, and I'm pleased that I could be here along with Pastor Hoisler to lead you in worship today. And as always, every time we gather for worship, we hear God's Word, we read God's Word, we hear and read about God's great love for each of us through His Son and through our Savior, Jesus Christ. And in addition to hearing and reading about that love of God, I pray that while you're with us, you experience that same love of God. So if you are physically able, take a moment now, stand up, greet those around you in the love of God. Life in this world is scary. It is filled with all sorts of sharks and things ready to devour you. But no matter what the sharks in your world, know that you are baptized. Know that a loving Heavenly Father, an all-powerful Heavenly Father is with you. God will be with you. God will pull you through. And what better gift, what better preparation can we give our children than to have them baptized and to teach them daily about their baptism because we find love and strength, we find meaning and purpose for life when we daily proclaim, I am baptized. Amen. 